The Double by Fyodor Dostoevsky is a psychological novella that delves into the complexities of the human mind, exploring themes of identity, alienation, and the disintegration of self. Published in 1846, this work showcases Dostoevsky's profound understanding of the human psyche, foreshadowing the psychological depth that would later characterize his more renowned novels. The narrative centers around Yakov Petrovich Goliadkin, a low-ranking government clerk living in St. Petersburg. Goliadkin's mundane and routine existence takes a bizarre turn when he encounters his doppelganger, a man identical to him in appearance but possessing a contrasting personality. This doppelganger, referred to as Goliadkin Jr., becomes the embodiment of Goliadkin's repressed desires, fears, and insecurities. Dostoevsky skillfully employs the doppelganger motif to unravel the protagonist's internal struggles. Goliadkin's encounter with his double catalyzes a psychological unraveling, exposing the fault lines in his fragile sense of self. The doppelganger is not merely a physical replica, it symbolizes the fragmented nature of Goliadkin's consciousness. The novella becomes a journey into the recesses of the protagonist's mind, exploring the conflict between his idealized self-image and the harsh reality of his existence. The setting of The Double in 19th-century Russia provides a backdrop that amplifies the protagonist's sense of alienation. Goliadkin's social standing, reflected in his position as a government clerk, accentuates his marginalization within a hierarchical society. Dostoevsky utilizes this social context to underscore the broader theme of individual alienation, a theme that resonates beyond the confines of Goliadkin's personal predicament. The narrative unfolds with a sense of psychological inevitability, mirroring Goliadkin's descent into madness. The author employs a first-person narrative, immersing the reader in Goliadkin's increasingly distorted perspective. This narrative choice serves to intensify the emotional impact of the novella, as the reader witnesses Golly Atkins' internal torment with an unsettling immediacy. Dostoevsky's exploration of identity extends beyond the individual to encompass societal expectations and the pressure to conform. Golly Atkins attempts to assert his identity and resist assimilation into the collective consciousness of the society around him reflect the broader existential struggles faced by individuals in a rapidly changing world. The novella thus becomes a microcosm of the societal tensions and psychological disintegration prevalent in 19th-century Russia. The symbolism in The Double adds layers of meaning to the narrative. The recurring motif of mirrors and reflections serves as a visual metaphor for self-perception and the fractured nature of Goliadkin's consciousness. The doppelganger, as a literal reflection of Goliadkin, embodies the protagonist's subconscious desires and anxieties. This symbolic interplay enriches the narrative, inviting readers to unravel the deeper layers of meaning embedded in the text. Dostoevsky's narrative style in The Double is characterized by a blend of realism and surrealism. The author masterfully blurs the lines between the tangible and the hallucinatory, creating an atmosphere of psychological tension. This stylistic choice contributes to the novella's immersive and disorienting quality, allowing readers to experience Goliadkin's psychological turmoil firsthand. In conclusion, The Double stands as a testament to Fyodor Dostoevsky's exploration of the human psyche and societal dynamics. Through the lens of Goliadkin's disintegrating identity, the novella addresses universal themes of alienation, self-perception, and the struggle for individuality. Dostoevsky's masterful use of symbolism, setting, and narrative technique elevates the double beyond a mere psychological study, making it a timeless and thought-provoking work that continues to resonate with readers across generations.